All right, Shalom. First and foremost, we're going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakal Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to the elect men pushing this sound doctrine throughout the four corners of the earth in truth and sincerity. You no know, standing upon their watch, re uh, waiting on the return of our uh, of our Lord, Yahweh Shai. You know, to get us out of this, uh, to bring us out of this wicked, hard captivity that we're in. You know, peace and salutations to all the sincere men pushing this doctrine, man, you know. Yeah, uh, I'm the brother of Bar. I know, buddy. Yeah, we just came together through the spirit and power Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shai, you know, to do a quick and transit lesson. We're just going to get right in the scriptures. Bring it up. It's Sirach 39 and 1. But he that giveth his mind to the law of the Most High. Yeah, but he that giveth his mind to the law of the Most High. He that giveth his spirit, his all, his heart to the law of the Most High. Okay? You know, the 613 law, statutes, and commandments. He that, uh, he, he's heart is, um, he whose heart is aimed at, uh, pleasing Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, you know? And also doing what our Lord Yahweh Shai told us, which is what, feeding his flock. All right? Which, 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 which we're doing right now. You know, Yahweh brought this out. This lesson will be edifying. Continue. And is occupied in the meditation thereof. Yes, yeah, occupied in the meditation of the, of the law, you know? Because that's how you show Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, that you love him. That's how you show your power that you love him, man. By doing as he say, as scripture says, if you love me, you keep my commandments. Continue. Will seek out the wisdom of all the ancients and be occupied in prophecy. Yeah, we'll seek out the wisdom of all the ancients, all, all of our ancient forefathers. Okay, all of the great men, great men in the scrolls. Okay, and that's what we're doing. We're, we're searching out that that old path. You know. Okay, we uh we, we put off the old man and what we're going back to our uh, to our ancient customs. Okay, rehearsing the righteous acts. Before uh, the kingdom of heaven is established here upon earth. Read that last part again, huh? It's a lot. It's, uh, <sighs> Read it again from the top, though. It's a lot. It's uh, Sirach 39 and 1. Mm -hmm. But he that giveth his mind to the law of the Most High, and is occupied in the meditation thereof, will seek out the wisdom of all the ancients, yep. and be occupied in prophecy. Yeah, and be occupied in prophecy. Okay, because this is the year of prophecy, man, you know? We're right, we're, we're right now, you know, uh, uh, almost one week until the new year, the official new year, and one week away from the uh, Passat. All right, and you see, man, the tension is high, man. You know, you got, you got, you got uh, Jake bringing our wayward doctrines and being proud. Okay, you got the scoffers, man. You know, scoffing. You got these demons intensifying. You got the men of the Lord going harder and harder. Okay, and what we're occupied in prophecy, man. Ain't no busybodies, you know, amongst um the sincere men of Great Millstone. All right, because there is some um some demons, you know, some unawares crept in, but the Most High is gonna sift them out. All right, but our job as men of the Lord is to what? Watch the prophecies. Get uh, Revelation 19, 19 and 10, man. You know, because this is what sets us apart from all these uh, other Israelite groups. All right, you know, we busy, man. We, we busy, man, watching the times. You know. So many things to, to go into, so many things that uh that are going on throughout the planet Earth, you know, and it's all could be filtered, and it all could be filtered through the scriptures. You got it up. Huh? Is uh Revelation 19 and 10, mm -hmm. and I fell at his feet to worship him. This is uh this is John the Revelator fell at his feet to worship the angel. Continue. And he said unto me, See thou do it not. Uh -huh. I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren that have the testimony of your house shy. Yep. Worship the Most High, for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. Yeah, so we're to worship the Most High, Yahweh by Shimi Yahweh Shai, and be occupied in prophecy. All right, and then what? To worship? Uh, what, read it again, Axelaki. It's Revelation 19 and 10. And I fell at his feet to worship him, mm -hmm. and he said unto me, See thou do it not. I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren yep. that have the testimony of Yahweh Shai. Yeah, so the angel has a testimony of Yahweh Shai. All right, and that's how we overcome this um this beast, you know. All right, by what the, the testimony of Yahweh Shai. Continue. Worship the Most High, for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. Yeah, the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. Okay. It's the spirit of is the spirit of prophecy, man. And to prophesy means to say something before it happens. Okay? And everything that's gonna happen, man, not not knowing exactly how it's gonna happen, but we hey, the, the sum of it all, man, is what? The so-called white man is gonna come down upon the nation of Israel with great wrath, because he knows that he have a short time. He's gonna push his RFID micro trying to establish it, trying to establish trying to establish his new world order, Salakia. 
okay? And World War III is going to pop off, nuclear missiles, all this is plain to see. And our Lord Yahweh Shai is going to return, and the kingdom of heaven is going to be set up forever. Okay? And this is what we're watching for. You got, uh, you got a precept up? Revelation 12 12. Bring it up. It's Revelation. Uh, start at um, 11. It's Revelation 12 and 11. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. Yeah, and they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. And who is him? That's the beast. Okay? That's Esau, man, and his wicked ass system. That's the spiritual demon Satan, you know? By the blood of the Lamb. Who's the Lamb? Yahweh Shai. Okay, and that's the blood that, that, um, that's, that's covering his elect in this um, Passover that's coming. You know, continue. And by the word of their testimony. Yeah, there it is. And what's the testimony? of uh, The testimony of Yahweh Shai. That's how you're going to overcome this beast. Continue. And they love not their lives unto the Because we ain't living. You know? But hey, well, we, we yearn to live, man. We know our, uh, our rest is coming soon. All right, but this life right here ain't nothing, man. All right. Jake, hey, Jacob, be a martyr for this truth, you know? There's no greater uh, love, man, than to lay down your life for your brethren, man. Yahweh Shai died for us. So death, is, hey, we, we ain't worried about it, man. This will be the, if, if a brother's a martyr, man, the Most High is going to put the spirit on you to take it, all right? And if you do be put to death, man, you're going to be the uh, the first ones in the chariot, man. And this will be the last time that you ever taste death. All right, so we ain't scared, man. We've, we've been we've, we've been killed before, all right? But the Most High also said that, that his, uh, his pocket should not be pushed into a corner anymore. Continue up. Therefore rejoice ye heavens, yep. and ye that dwell in them. Yep. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth. Yeah, woe well, destruction to the inhabitants of the earth. Because the uh the, the 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 son of perdition is in rulership. The wicked is in rulership. Alright. You know, continue. And of the sea. Yep. For the devil has come down unto you having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time. Yeah, the so-called white man is the devil. All right, he's coming. He's gonna come down upon the uh, upon all mankind, but you know, chiefly the uh, the nation of Israel, because he know they have a sh uh, have but a short time, a short time to do what to establish his uh his new world order and basically to be in rulership. Cause he see these these camps popping up, see brothers going hard. You can flag our pages. All right, but we're gonna to continue to prophesy against Mount Seir as commanded in Ezekiel the thirty fifth chapter. You know, got anything else out? Get uh. Isaiah 62 and 6. Yeah. Isaiah. We're going to continue to stand upon our watch, man. It's yeah. Isaiah 62 and 6. I have set watchmen upon their walls, O Jerusalem. Yeah, that's who, we watch, that's who we watch for, man, you know? That's who the good news is for, the nation of Israel. Okay, but we tell all nations what's coming, man. You know? But hey, but the gospel is for, uh, it's for the elect. Right now, you know, but ultimately it's the whole nation. All right, with the new the new covenant, you know, two thirds of our people are gonna uh, you know, they're gonna they're gonna be uh, come come back through the loins of the elect, okay. But right now we're on the watch for uh for for, for Jerusalem, man, you know, telling our people, hey, the, the, the devil is in power, you know, never trust thine enemy, okay. Why you gonna be hand in hand with the so-called white man? Are oh, he's gonna bring uh destruction, man? You know, he's out he's out to uh completely annihilate the uh the nation Israel. Okay, that's why we're on our watch to, to tell our people that the Lord is getting ready to return, man, in a glorious fashion, all right? And, and the Lord is going to kill many, many people, all right? Scripture says the slain of the Lord shall be many. This is all prophecy. Continue. Which shall never hurt the, hold their peace day nor night. Yeah, which shall never hold their peace day nor night, okay? Sun just went down, and we, hey, we're doing the video. Videos is going up 24-7, man. All right, brothers is watching the time, man. You know, and, and what, and doing uh, videos on, on articles, or even just going into into history, okay? Brothers is not holding their peace, man. You know, like King David said, "I believe, therefore I have uh, have spoken." You know, I was greatly afflicted. All right, so if you believe, you gonna speak. You believe, you gonna teach. You believe, you gonna prophesy, man. If if the spirit is something with you, you have to prophesy. Continue up. Ye that make mention of the Lord, keep not silence. And ye that make mention of the Lord, Yahweh by Shem Shai, keep not silence. All right? Hey, as Jeremiah said, man, there's a fire in his, in his bone. All right? Hey, get that, uh, Jeremiah. Is it, you got more on that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'll pull it up. You can continue. And give him no rest till he establish, until he make Jerusalem a praise in the earth. Yeah, give him no rest until he quam Yasserala. He raised Israel. You know, give him no rest until Yahweh Shah is back, man. Give him no rest until we in, until we in the chariots. 
All right, give them no rest until our um our pleading and our signing and our crying turns into us just totally glorifying the, the Lord, praising Him. You know, call Halal Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shai. You know, but until now, man, it's Baba Kasha. Right now, you know, it's Baba Kasha Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shai. You know, um, a ba 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 shatan, a ba out of one. Destroy this, destroy this place. You know, give him no rest until he establishes and make Jerusalem a praise in the earth. Okay, because we've been on the bottom, bottom for so long that our people think this is where we're supposed to be. You know, well, this ain't this. This is not our natural estate. You know, as the scripture says, I've seen servants upon horses. You know what that's that? In Ecclesiastes. I got that. I got that. Huh? Yep. Yeah. This ain't the natural order, man. You know, King Solomon, he's seen this, man. He's seen things, you know, the uh, everything completely out of order, man. You know, this life right here is, is, is vanity, man. If it wasn't for us preaching this word, man, you know, this life right here would be nothing. You know? Is uh, Ecclesiastes 10 and 7. I have seen servants upon horses and princes walking as servants upon the earth. Yeah, servants upon horses. And who's the servant? Man, uh, the so-called white man. And the horse represents what? Uh, power, rulership. Okay. So this is this is uh this is off, man. Y'all got the basis nation, the nation that the Most High made to destroy, ruling over the uh, nation that the Most High chose to rule. God. You know? It's upside down. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Read it again one more time, huh? Is he Ecclesiastes ten and seven? I have seen servants upon horses and princes walking as servants upon the earth. Yeah, and princes walking as servants upon the earth. All right, because that's what uh, Yashavala goes back to. He is the prince of the power. All right? And we're, because we're princes, man, you know? Soon to be uh, kings, man, be back, in our, be back in rulership forever. All right? This is the gospel. This is the good news. You know? So right now, we got the so-called white man, the, the base nation, all about the decree of the, of the Most High, you know? All about the, you know, that's it. Getting that kind. All about the decree of the Most High. All right, this is his will. Okay, but he's getting ready to establish a, 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 a righteous kingdom, as it tells you in Sirach, the, the 10th chapter. In due time, the Lord will, will set up over, uh, uh, set, set up a ruler, you know, who's uh, who, who's worthy, who's prudent. Profitable. Profitable. The water, uh, and that's Yahweh Shai, with the elect being joint heirs with him. The water, uh, you got it. This uh, Daniel 4 and 17. Mm -hmm. This matter is by the decree of the watchers mm -hmm. and the demand by the word of the holy ones. Yep. To the intent that the living may know. Yeah, to the intent that the living may know. We letting, hey, we letting uh, the, 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 the world know, man. All right, that the most high. Continue. It's like Jake jumping the gun. To the intent that the living may know that the most high ruleth in the kingdom of men. Yeah, the most high ruleth in the kingdom of men. Okay, Job 9.24 tells you that the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. All right, this this, this so-called white man wasn't all powerful and, and 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 mighty that he that he took the nation down by uh force. It was all of him. No, it was what they call what they call it manifest uh destiny. God. Yeah, this was all the Most High's will. The Most High ruled in the kingdom of man. You know, declaring the end from the beginning. So if you declare the end from the beginning, then what? The, hey, the whole thing is is covered. The whole thing is declared. The whole thing is uh is the heavenly Father's will. You know, the whole the whole movie, so to speak. Cause that's all that's all we're in. You know, continue. And give it it to whomsoever he will. Yeah, give it to, to whomsoever he will. And we know who's uh we, we know what his will is according to his word. Alright? Because the most high he he's bound by his word. He's not a man that he should lie. Okay? So in, in the book of Daniel, the vision that Daniel had, man, you know, it was set up that this is exactly how it was gonna go. Okay, but it also tells you that the saints of the most high shall take the kingdom and possess the kingdom forever and ever. Even and ever, you know. This is the time that we're coming into, man. You know? Get um get second Thessalonians 2 and 8. You know? I just got a little, oh, you got a little more? Continue. So I can. And set up over it the bases of men. And set up over it the bases of men. Alright? Esau's a base man. He's a vile man. As it tells you in the book of Job. He's viler than the earth. He's he's the lowest. Okay, look at look at the planet Earth and uh under the rulership of the so-called white man. Alright? You stupid people don't even know that he wants to just completely do away with, with humankind. You know, with mankind. Or just because, you know, the, um, what they call it, the, uh, the, uh, the Georgia Guidestone is not out there no more. It was all, it's already known, though. He wants to, to take the world population down to 500 million. You know, roughly killing, killing over roughly like 7 billion people, man. You know? 
this is the this is the basis, man. This is the devil in rulership, you know. Yeah, I was going to going to take them out, man, with a with a, uh, a marvelous, a dramatic destruction, you know. Wow. All right, and we playing our our part now, you know. This is us this is us taking the kingdom from uh from the so-called white man from Esau, you know, pushing his word. Matter of fact, start at three, huh? He's a uh, Second Thessalonian two and three. Mm -hmm. Let no man deceive you by any means. Yep. For that day shall not come except there come a falling away first. Yeah, yeah, and we and we fell away from our power, you know? But being returned, what well, we seeking them ten times more now, the elect are, okay? And not just with uh with with, with, with these like these pseudo-Israelite camps, man. You know, on some Israelite party shit, man. We seeking the Lord in work, you know, in faith and work. Alright? But yeah, we fell away from who we was. Maybe we thought we were what? Negroes, Dominicans. You know, uh, Puerto Ricans, Native Americans, all these proverbs and, and bywords, the so-called white man, the basis men, our, uh, our arch enemy put upon us. Yeah. All right, but we're coming back to know that we're princes of the power, okay? We're uh, Benjamites, Levites, Ephraimites, Simeonites, Judites, all right? Making up the 12 tribes of Israel, the princes of the power. The so-called white man, he's in, he's in, he, he's in, uh, he's in fear, you know? Said, it tells you in the book of Revelation, and great fear fell upon him. Revelation 11 chapter. All right, this, you everyday uh, Edomites, you know, y'all, y'all, y'all ain't tripping about the Israelites, but y'all are tripping about the uh, the uprising of Jake. Like after this Black Panther move, movie, you know, they see Jake is getting roused up. But what's really rousing Jake up is this word, you know. Continue up. And that man of sin be revealed. Yeah, and that man of sin be revealed. Okay, the man of sin, the man who who whose whole Whose whole structure, whose whole spirit is not upright. His whole his whole mindset is to transgress the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High. All right, he's revealed. It's the so-called white man. The so-called white man is the devil. All right, Esau is the devil, man. You Edomites are are uh, Satan's people. Okay, you're completely adversarial to the Most High and His Son. Continue. The son of perdition. Yeah, the son of destruction, and that's what he's bringing. That's what he has brought. Okay. Most High put the spirit on him to create missiles to destroy to destroy himself, to destroy his own. What, what he built up this shithole that he created. Continue. Who opposeth and exalted himself above all that is called the Most High? Yeah, who opposeth? All right, because he's completely uh, adversarial. Like I say, he's, he, he he opposes the Most High and the Most High's people, uh, and he exalted himself. Okay, above all that is called the Most High. So-called white man has a mentality. You know, his, his mindset is, hey, there is no God, okay? According to, uh, you know, uh, Psalms 14 and 1, the fool has said in his, in his heart that there is no God, you know? But, hey, if you do want to believe that there's a God, he looks like me, all right? And he exalted himself above Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai and Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's people, the nation of Israel. Continue. Or that is worship so that he as the Most High sitteth in the temple of the Most High Showing himself that he is the most high. Yeah, he did that through what? Through iconoclasm, icon iconoclasm, you know, through going through the uh, in the Renaissance period. Okay, so Paul was uh, he, he was prophesying, man, which he had, he had already been doing back then, you know. I tell you in the book of Maccabees, he, he laid open the book of the law, you know, and, and, and what and, and, and sought to change the image like unto himself, just roughly paraphrasing it. That's the works of the so-called white man. Here it is, a so-called white man, you know, and he's brought nothing but death, but he wanted to make it seem like, like the great, you know, like the greatest person to walk the earth who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ comes from his line. Man, ain't no so-called white person, man, gonna, um, gonna die, like they say, for everybody. You know, wish the Lord didn't die for everybody, but that's the picture that they try to, that they try to paint. You know, this people, this destructive people, man, you know, who's out to kill and destroy everything, had a man from their line that just died for everybody. That suffered the worst death for everybody. Hell no. Nah. Get the hell out of here, man. You so-called white people, man. Yeah, y'all gotta pay for that, man. You know? You gotta pay double. Continue. Remember ye not that when I was with you. I mean slug you. Remember ye not that when I was with was yet with you, I told you these things. Alright, hey, so uh so Apostle Paul, hey, he told us, he's telling us now, man, you know? Now, we heard this in our in our past life, you know. Okay, we once knew this. The scripture said, "Will therefore put you in remembrance, though you once knew this." Okay, so we once had this uh this 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 uh this doctrine, you know. 
But now, man, we got it back in its, in its fullness. Okay, with all the prophets he's speaking. All right, this is a, a, a beautiful time to be alive. You know what I mean? Just to be alive, you know what I mean? To be a, a, alive, you know, be breathing. Okay, like, uh, you know, because the two-thirds are in the congregation of the dead. This is, the beautiful t this is the beautiful time to be quickened, you know, by this word. That's to be alive. Continue up. And ye, and now ye know that withhold it that he might be revealed in his time. And this is the time he's being revealed. It's being exposed, man. The so-called white man is being exposed for being the devil. Okay, continue. For the mystery of iniquity do already work. Yeah, the mystery of iniquity was already in works back then, you know? What's this, you know, the time of the Greeks and the Romans? He was already being the damn devil, you know? Being, being wicked, he already put hell upon our people. He already crucified the Lord, you know? He already put uh, uh, the, the southern kingdom in hardcore uh, su subjection in, uh, in the Greek empire, you know? Put hell upon our upon our people. You can read about that in the book of Maccabees. He had already been in the works, you know? But he came back now even, even harder, you know? Why? Because he knew that he had but a short time. He know the so-called white man, the so-called Jew, he know who we are. And we know who he is. And we and we're exposing him through the spirit of power behind by Shim Yahushai. Continue. Only he who now let it will let mm -hmm. until he be taken out of the way. Yeah, only he who only he who, who now will let it will let until he be taken out of the way. And he's getting ready to be taken out of the way. Alright, he's getting ready to be put out of put out of existence. Alright? According to the book of Obadiah. Alright, as a matter of fact, we're gonna, we're gonna end it off on that after we get this out. Huh? Okay. Let you finish that off. And then that shall the, shall the wicked be revealed. Yep. Whom the Lord have, shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. Yeah, who the Lord, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. And who's the spirit of the Lord's mouth? The, uh, the prophets. Okay? The men who put their life on the line daily, you know? Risking their lives, man. You know what I mean? For the kingdom of heaven. Risking their lives for Yahweh by Shem Shai. All right, with, with with no problem, man. With no not not thinking twice. All right, this is what the uh what the mouthpiece of the Most High was, was put on the planet Earth and this go around to do, to consume the wicked. All right, continue. And shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. Yeah, Yahweh Shai is going to destroy the wicked with the brightness of his coming. Okay, when he returns in a glorious fashion. All right, this this is a prophecy, man. Okay, that the Lord is going to return, man, in uh in in a day of judgment. You know. Get that uh, Obadiah right around. I think uh, you can get right to the point, man. The house of Jacob should be a, a, a fire. And the house of Esau for stubble. There's uh, Obadiah 1 and 18. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire. Yep. And the house of Joseph a flame. That's representing the, uh, the, the southern kingdom and the northern kingdom. All right. Because the most high, what, according to Ezekiel, what's that, the 37th chapter? And he had brought the tribe together. Uh, uh, Amos, the ninth chapter, around what, the, uh, the 10th verse? The Lord will rebuild the house of David. Okay. When I had been Judah for me and filled the bow with Ephraim. Okay. Continue up. And the house of Esau for stubble. Yeah, and the house of Esau for stubble. Continue. And they shall kindle in them and devour them. Yeah, and they shall kindle in them and devour them. All right. And that's what we're going to do to you Edomites. We're going to devour the nation of Edom. All right. <laughs> Thus says the Bible. The brother's reading it. Continue. And there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau. Yeah, and there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau. There should be no Edomites remaining. You know? And every time I hear that, I just want to give the Lord a, a round of applause, man. You know, that's that's the gospel. Uh, Ain't going to be no more pasty devils on the planet Earth. Tired of looking at you fuckers, man. Yeah, tired of looking at you damn devils, man. You know, that was it on that, huh? For the Lord has spoken it. Yeah, for the Lord, you how about Shimei Hussai has spoken it. All right, the Most High is not a man that he should lie. Okay? So, hey, so that's, hey, that's what it is, man. You know? Hey, with that, man, we're going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakal Kodash, and hey, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who we learn this truth from. Peace and blessings to the elect. Shalom. Shalom.